leaves and whole plant are digestive, diuretic, and febrifuge, hypotensive, narcotic, anesthetic, sedative and stimulant. It is used internally in the treatment of sore eyes, diarrhea, nausea, indigestion, colic, hiccups, rheumatism, malaria and feverish illnesses. Externally, it is used to treat scorpion bites and to remove ticks. Use of the plant depresses the central nervous system, whilst it is also reputedly anesthetic and hallucinogenic. Lucida was one of the most widely used medicinal plants in western Mexico. Whole plant is dried and made into a tea by Indians for treating scorpion bites, fever, ague, and diarrhea and also as an aphrodisiac. Leaves are softened in water and taken internally to cure hiccups. In ceremonies, the Huical Indians from the Sierra Madre Mountains reportedly have visions when smoking the herb in combination with the consumption of fermented tarragon tea, which is prepared the same way Sinecuichi is prepared. People who had been struck by lightning were treated with extracts of taked lucida. Lucida is one of the plants most used by the Latin American population for the treatment of gastrointestinal disorders. In Mexico, Fresh herbage of taked lucida is used as a tea for abdominal pains, to calm stomachs, to relax nerves and to alleviate the symptoms of a hangover. Juice that has been pressed from the herbage or crushed leaves are mixed with water or wine and drunk as an aphrodisiac in Mexico. Tea of the plant is also used as a stimulant. It has been recognized since Spanish colonial times that taked lucida has aphrodisiac effects. In Mexico, it is believed that the herbage promotes lactation. It is also used as a bath additive to treat rheumatism. In India, juice from freshly pressed leaves is administered to treat eczema in India. Decoction of the leaves is drunk for coughs, and when applied topically on the skin in Argentina. It is well known as an insect repellent. It was also believed during Spanish colonial times to treat the clinically insane. Taked lucida is an aromatic herb distributed naturally in Central and South America, where it is used as a spice, for medicinal purposes, as insecticide, for religious purposes and as ornamental plant. Taked lucida has played an important role in social, cultural and religious rites since the Aztec era till today in Mexico and Guatemala. Flowers are importantly used in religious Catholic and indigenous festivities especially in ceremonies for the dead and in the Catholic All Souls Days. Taked's flowers are normally used for arcs and altar decorations. Even today, many Mexican Indians burn the dried foliage of Taked's lucida as incense on their home altars and during public ceremonies. They would sprinkle a powder of the plant into the faces of prisoners of war who were to be burned as sacrifices, so that they would be sedated during their ordeal. Hugh Eagle, Indians of the Sierra Madre of Mexico would smoke dried herbage of tea. Lucida, commonly referred to as tumutsli, alone or mixed with tobacco from Nicosiana rustica. This smoking mixture, although sometimes smoked recreationally, does have ceremonial importance and hallucinogenic effects. It is reported to be smoked as a rite of passage in sexual shamanic rituals, most likely due to its aphrodisiac effects. Bundles of the dried herbage are placed as offerings in temples, administrative buildings and sacred sites. Dried leaves and flowers are also smoked in cigarettes made from corn husks, often in combination with the ingestion of peyote. The combinations of smoking the herbage of taked lucida along with consuming peyote, tesquino or nawa, fermented maize beverage, or homemade sai or sota, cactus liquor, are believed to produce very active, vivid hallucinations. Mexican tarragon is an attractive landscape ornamental often used in perennial borders. Secretions from the roots of growing plants have an insecticidal effect on the soil and are reported to be effective against nematodes, keeled slugs and couch grass weed. Growing plant also has a repellent effect on various insect pests such as the asparagus beetle and bin weevils. Dried plant is burnt as incense and to repel insects. Yellow dye obtained from the flowers is used for textile. An essential oil extracted from this plant 
known as taked soil, is used for the production of cosmetics, food flavorings and in the pharmaceutical industry. In Mexican folk art, a wide variety of skulls and skeletons made of wood, paper mac or sugar associated with All Saints Day are oftentimes painted with decorative taked flowers. Please like share and subscribe.